I'll do a recap for the Iraq dinar situation. And how it is going to play out based on the news we were seeing right now follow the thread, and you would understand first, we know the dollar has been set to collapse this September. The decision was made last year 2023. Second, Iraq bought a lot of dollars but it seems like they do not have enough dinar against it to cover up the values and expenses so they claimed they will turn on the printer, if they did, it will cause huge inflation. Then Iraq claimed they will sell their oil with dinar instead of the dollar, but first they need to back up the dinar with gold, which means they cannot turn on the printer if it is backed up by gold, because that is a huge problem by itself beside inflation. After that, they admitted they will not print more notes, because if they're gonna back up the currency with gold, they cannot print more notes, they will be forced to change the rate to cover the expenses they have for all the ministries and salaries at the end of September. Also, Iraq finished training new people for exchanging currencies as it was required by an official letter from the CBI a month ago. Here Iraq is going international. By allowing their banks to make cross-border payment with different currencies, other than the dollar. Plus joining Visa, MasterCard, MoneyGram that works on XRP and XLM. Also, it came on the news that Iraq had an agreement with US to pull USA military out of Iraq by September. This agreement happened at the beginning of July but Trump stated there will not pull out of Iraq unless they are getting paid. If Iraq right now in deep shit because they cannot cover up the expenses of their ministries and citizens' salaries. How are they going to pay these military people they have to change the rate to be able to pay off everything? Finally, you gotta understand. Iraq in a deep shit financially they will be forced to change the rate to pay off everything and back their currency with gold. Also, Brikes meeting on Oct any country wants to join Brikes they have to ditch the dollar aside. Fire we are close. Last thing, Kuwait had their money backed by gold before the Gulf War. Then, after the war, they backed it to the old rate before the war, because it is the same currency that is backed by gold before and after the war. Iraq will do the same and bring the old rate before the war 3.22. Here is the proof of U.S. military withdrawing out of Iraq beginning this September and end on September 2025. As Trump stated, none of the troops will get out unless they are getting paid. The rate has to change this month, so the troops can start withdrawing and be paid. Fire fire fire! Amazing great news Iraq admitting that they have to back up the currency with gold by the order of IMF+. Plus. The Federal Bank in USA admitted that there is a collapse of the dollar.